With the global aid collapsing, self-reliance is the new buzzword in Africa's health sector. Last week in Durban, South Africa, leaders at the fourth International Conference on Public Health in Africa didn't mince their words. The crisis in global health funding is real and it is also a chance for the continent to rewrite the rules. The big message, Africa's health security can't depend on anyone else. African leaders called on the continent's health community to transform crisis into opportunity, pointing out advances in vaccine manufacturing amid big job losses and reductions in aid. South Africa's Minister of Science, Blade Nzimande, called a new medicines manufacturing plan led by the Africa CDC a truly historic moment. It's a $3.2 billion commitment to ensure that by 2040, 60% of all vaccines used in Africa are made in Africa. As Nzimande put it, it's about equipping our people, scientists and manufacturers with the tools and skills to secure the continent's health sovereignty. The theme of the conference was moving towards self-reliance to achieve universal health coverage and health security in Africa. It comes as overseas aid is expected to fall by up to 28% this year. The event put a spotlight on Africa-led innovations policy solutions, and research aimed at building self-reliant healthcare systems tailored to the needs of local people. Africa CDC's Director General Jean Casella declared, for the first time, Africa is inspiring the world. So, can Africa build a self-reliant health system in the face of dwindling global aid? It's clear that even as aid cuts threaten vital programs, Africa is charting a new path. You can learn more about this in our news article, Turn Crisis into Opportunity, African Health Leaders on the SciDev.net website. We've included a link to the story in the comments.